And we're back. And we're back. We will work through this. We're you know three episodes in, and we're on rule number seven. Yep. So women mm-hmm. always look good, but not too good. Why not too good? Uh, O'Neill also notes that the emphasis on plain aesthetics wasn't just to make sure the wife appeared chastate, but also looking out for his funds by being not too fashionable, so that she strained her husband's oh, pocketbook. Money, money is the reason. To be putting on airs. <laughs> Yeah. There you go. Well, see, I've got probably some controversial issues on this. Right. I personally like to at least try and make an effort at not looking like a fucking slob when I go out the house. That is a lot of effort for you. That is a lot of effort, but I put it in. (laughs) I do put it in. So, like, obviously, I I tend to wear, like, just joggers around the house, just like slob clothes, basically. Mm. But if I need to nip to the corner shop, I will still change into jeans. And just to not look oh, like yeah, a you're wearing jeans now. Yeah, see? So, it, I don't know. There's just, like, something in me which, like... I think people should have... Decency is the wrong word, but, like, have a little bit of, like... Like, self-awareness when it comes to... What do I look like? Do I look like a fucking state? No, because, cause I'm like, some people are ugly. There's no getting away from that. They're just plain ugly, right? And if it's, like, a deformity and it, it's, like, something they can't help... It's like, okay, I can understand that. It's, you know, it's, it's not really an issue. But if, like, if you go out looking like a state because you've let yourself become a state, yeah. like, at least have the decency to put some clothes on and just, just you know, not look... And that goes for men and women. That's not just any, you know, any particular shit, any particular gender. It's just, like, have some self-respect, yeah. you know? I right. mean, uh, what was it? It was Jess's nan's 70th the other day, so we went out for dinner. And uh, even then, I had a shave and got my hair cut. Yeah. And I ironed a shirt for her. Like. <laughs> I mean, that's a lot for me. I've come over here. I haven't shaved since then. Yeah. I've had, I've had, well, I haven't cut my hair because it's only been a couple of weeks, but I'm wearing a t shirt and a pair of jeans and I'm in my slippers. Yeah. But, so like, like, but you're, you're dressed and you don't look like you've just been, like, dragged out of a skip. You know, you're, you're acceptable as you are. But. I don't for know. you, I'm I don't know really what point I'm making. Just, like, if. if for you, I'm too acceptable, I think. I look, there's a certain... Yeah, you, well, yeah, you better... Yeah, no, no. I don't know why I was agreeing with that. Thinking about it, you're, you're, I can do a lot better than you. Um, and yet, I am still here. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why. I think at the moment, I think it's more of a convenience thing now. I'm just... A, because I'm always about... Yeah, when I go to California, yeah, yeah, it won't be convenient anymore. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> Might not be much of a... Uh, Shit, can I do it? Oh, I thought I could. <laughs> I don't, know, I don't know what point I was like, and I just just think everyone should have a level of sort of. Um, so basically, bear yeah. in mind that as, like aesthetics are, are. Look at the ass on that. Look at the face on that. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> but I think you was just emphasising the point that not. Like, there's a like reason architecture good, but... is like you know, pe- people take their time designing buildings to look beautiful because it's it's going to be in the public eye, and they want things to look nice. There's, you know, when things are nice, people are happy. When an area looks, you know, beautiful, it's just a nice place. I think the same should apply to people. You know, people should try and look, you know, look, try and look nice for themselves as well as everyone else. You know what I mean? Hmm? I, I include myself in that. You know, men and women and and, and everyone else really. Mm-hmm. I was saying that with my new role, my boss was going through. She was like, "Yeah, now you've got to start wearing a shirt to work and blah 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 blah." I was like, God, it sounds like I've got to start making an effort and like shaving weekly as well. And that was it. She asked me, she's like, now you've got to wear after shave and blah, blah, blah. Do you know what I mean? Given the whole spiel, yeah. like, you, now you've got to make the real effort, whereas you can just turn up in whatever, hair a mess, and it mm. doesn't really matter because you're service, you're not, you're not office stuff. Yeah. Now I'm office stuff. It's, yeah, you've got to make an effort. I was like, God, next thing you'll be expecting me to shave weekly. Yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> I've, I've never been told to shave for my job. No, she, she was saying it in jest. Like, yeah, yeah, it wasn't, yeah, yeah. It wasn't a serious thing. It wasn't a case of, nope, this is now the rules. But yeah. So, so I, but you should see me. Like sometimes I'll go two months without cutting my hair, mm. and at the minute my hair's doing this weird thing where it's sort of like bouffons. It just goes up and round. Yeah. It doesn't f- flat. It, <laughs> it doesn't. But you're. I'm, I'm jealous of your hair doing that. Like when you grow your hair long, it's so sexy because it's so much volume and, and uh, it's just it's super sexy. And I don't know why you cut it. I do want to grow it, but I just don't like the awkward stage in the middle where it's not quite long enough to look good, but it's too short to look respectable do you know what I mean yeah but then once you get to that long stage you then cut it off 
You've done it before, you know, uh, when you was back in Kettering or wherever it was. No, once I, yeah, once I split up with the ex, I just didn't bother. Yeah. I think actually about well, three or four you were months still with before, her, yeah, you know, I didn't you, bother. But, but you looked sexy with your long hair, why did you cut it off? I think you got a job, actually, wasn't it? Yeah, and I think she asked out. me to do it a few shifts at the pub, so I was like, well, I'm going to be in the public now with people... He's paying me to be there, so I've got to look sort of... My, but but my your long hair was sexy. Like, it, it was I presentable. Wasn't. I just didn't I feel comfortable with the length it was. It was still just too short. We should have grown it longer then. <laughs> yeah, but... I was sort of trying to get myself back on track. It's like, I know what you mean, though, about like long hair. Like, I'm growing my hair back out again. I, I, my, my hair is constantly a change. It's like ever-changing. It's like, because I, I, I get sick of what it is at the moment and never fully achieve what I want to with it. Yeah. Um... So there's me, there's pictures of me with hair down to my shoulders and beyond. Yeah, yeah. There's pictures of me with shaved head, not clean but short. I know what you mean. Yeah, yeah. Um, I, the man bun was it was another phase. Your pegging handle. Uh, my pegging handle, as you call it. Um, oh shit! I started this episode. Have you not? I think we're about six minutes. No, well, welcome back. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, and no, I'm growing it long again. I cut off the man bun because the. The sides, because I originally got a, an, it's called an undercut, is it? Yeah, Where basically shaved sides, long top. Yeah. And I was pulling, like tying up the long part. But then the short part got long again, and I kind of didn't want to shave it off. So then it looked stupid, because I had like just stringy <laughs> bits on the side of my head looking out, it looked like a clown. Yeah. Um, so yeah, then I just, you know, just cut off the man bun, cut it all roughly to the same length, and I let it grow again, so that it's all going to be the same length long, and then I'm going to tie it back. Grow my beard back, and then just like one of those sexy um, lumber, um, what are they called? Something. Lumberjacks. Yeah, but there's a there's a name for it. It's called like um, a slumberjack or. What's oh, it, um, you're one se- of them hipsters. <laughs> well, yeah, kind of, but without the lumberjack stuff, I'm not into lumberjack. Yet. But you know, sexy with long hair and must like manly stubble and stuff like that. So mm. that's what I'm going to go for. Cool. I think. <laughs> I have no idea how long this episode's going to be. Well, the one time I let you let you take control, I was watching this. What was it? It was Dead Space or something like that. It was a 13-minute episode, because I was like, no, Twin, it's been this long. You're like, no, 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 it's been this long, we'll just carry on. It was a 13-minute episode, rather than 10. It's just come out, it was like this week it came out. I think I edited a Dead Space or Crash episode the other day, which was about 15, 20 minutes long. Really? <laughs> I think so. Why was it that long? Oh, fuck no, I can't remember why. Um, but it was. Oh, okay. But, uh, uh, you're you're the timer. We rely on you I have for the one timing. Job for, I have one job and I can't even do that. It's Basically, great. yeah, and you fucked that up. Like yep. it's very rare that the episodes. Well, not very rare, but no, like, most of the time they're, they're ten minutes. Bang on. Uh, like so, I, I, like add sort of twenty thirty seconds for the intro and outro. Um, I suppose we're not too bad then. Think no, about but it. <laughs> you can't just go. Yep, ten minutes. End of conversation now. When you're halfway through a flow, like two episodes ago, we're halfway through a flow. It was a twelve minute episode. Yeah. Because it was in a flow. You can't just stop that. Fuck. It just kills it. Mm. Yeah, well, I'd rather they go on longer than shorter. Like When when it's under 10 minutes, I feel like I've shortchanged the audience, even though no one's asked for this. <laughs> in fact, they're probably more likely to be like, why is this, Why have you put this out there? We want less of it. Yes. Um, but still, I feel I feel like we should at least like try and reach 10 minutes. Um, I, think, so, I think I don't have any episodes that have been under 10 minutes. I think there's been... It's been very few, if there are, but so, there have been hang a couple. On, we've done I think. what? Three hundred videos now. Uh, two hundred and forty-ish. Two hundred and forty of this of this upload date that you're viewing this um, as an audience, probably around two hundred and fifty. Okay, two hundred and fifty videos. So about one percent of them, would you say? Maybe two percent. Less than that. Less than two percent. Yeah, yeah. Ten minutes. Yeah. That's not bad. Oh no, That's we a do good well. Yeah. Forever. Oh yeah, yeah. But there's only been a couple that have been like bang on like 10 minutes within like 10 seconds either way. Oh yeah, well if you're getting more for your money you don't complain, do you? <laughs> no, true. You're welcome. You're welcome, uh, loyal fan base. Have we got one of them yet? Uh, there's a few names I see occasionally. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> uh, like we get comments occasionally from people who are long time viewers who don't comment regularly and occasionally they'll comment and I'm like, oh yeah, I remember you. <laughs> <laughs> so if you're one of those people that do watch regularly, just comment on this bit, on this episode just saying, hello, I'm still here, I still watch. And I will, I'll appreciate that very much and give you a little shout out, maybe. We usually do. Yeah, yeah. But then again, we normally we're at, do. We're at a comfortable size where if we see a name, we're like, yeah, let's shout them out. Yay! Yeah. But I, I think we'll be at a comfortable size to be able to do that for a while, to be honest. Oh, well, there you go. <laughs> so, I don't know whether to wrap it up here or give it a minute. Uh, call it the end of the episode, uh, end of this level. I end of this know. level. Ah, right, we'll uh, I did it. Oh. <laughs> but yeah, I remember you texted me, Tom, we've got a new fan. And you text me about it. Uh, yeah, who was it? 
I think she was watching Crash. Oh shit. Um, a new fan. Oh, you mean the, the other, a few weeks ago? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, someone left a comment that, uh, that that they liked our channel and they said you were really cute. So Richard has a fan that thinks he's cute, ladies and gentlemen. If you're that fan, I can't remember your, your username, but you know, thank you for watching. We're glad you subscribed. We're glad mm. you liked our shit. Uh, they are absolute bollocks. Um, but why on earth do you think Richard's just cute? <laughs> I know him too well to know that he is not cute. <laughs> I don't even think my girlfriend would say that, to be fair. No. <laughs> no, I don't think she would. Cute is not the word I'd use to describe you. Go on, describe me. Not cute. I keep dying, Richard. <laughs> Call it. Right, okay, we're doing it. Here. Right, in the next episode, uh, we we'll, we'll time it correctly. Are we going to do the level then start, or are we going to start from here? What? <laughs>